Basically it's parents um, or people who collect or watch or deliver um, kids to sporting events at grassroots levels that often are the ones that don't have the information. And so that really spurred us on our concussion campaign to try and get the information out to people. Um, so we decided we would develop an app, a concussion app. And this app would be available to everybody, whether you be an, uh, an elite player, whether you be a parent, whether you be a clinician, that you will get the information that you need at the level that you want it in order to help you deal with concussion. I suppose, first of all, just going through um, a concussion test. So say, for example, if there was um, a head injury to someone on the sideline, this is kind of just the quick check you can go through asking different questions so what venue are you at you might get one right the next few right or wrong and then um, at the end it just gives you uh, your score and then gives you advice based on that score one of the biggest worries is when you're dealing with someone you know on the side and it's kind of like how do I know it's concussion because as someone said you can't see it like a, like a broken leg or a broken hand this is where the signs and symptoms come in you know it gives you so many different uh, things from you know the variance of headache pressure in the head you just go through these uh, asking them how they feel and then you can click yes or no and then after that it gives you advice in terms of what you should be looking for after that. Well Medtronic is a very innovative medical device company and we're constantly looking at bringing expanding healthcare to meet unserved needs. This particular area uh, for this app brings healthcare to pitch sidelines. It helps uh, amateur m medical people on pitches particularly at junior level and underage levels uh, give a much better diagnosis and make much, much better decisions in relation to the serious problem of concussion playing games. 95% of concussions occur in recreational sports, not in the elite sports where they have doctors in the background. So they're the people we need to get the knowledge out to, to them, to their parents, to their coaches. So I think that's where the app is very, very important. So if there's a sign of a, of a player that's not moving, uh, or a player having a seizure, or a player who gets up and stumbles after taking a blow to the head. These are all worrying signs and, and indications for an immediate on-pitch assessment and stabilisation of and removal from the pitch uh, of an injured player. At, at that particular point when you are concussed, a player is not able to make the decision for himself. Uh, at, the back of his, at the back of his brain, all he, all he wants to do is, is, is win the match. and he, He's putting himself in danger and, he, and he's also no use to the team. Uh, so, so definitely it needs to be ta taken out of, the, out of the player's hands in, in that situation, yeah. The first thing, and crucially, is education, because the people, by and large, who are volunteers who run the game, I'm not worried about the elite level, I'm worried about the ordinary level, volunteers have a, a sketchy knowledge. And then the second thing is there must be rule change, and we could change the game. American football has made rule change to change it, uh, other sports are doing it, there's no reason why we couldn't do it for rugby, and we're not. It's madness. I suppose if you ask players um, six or seven years ago back in cushion, they might have uh, fopped it off. But I suppose now it's 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 highlighted so much in, in the media and uh, in 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 various other sports that players are a lot more aware of it and they're taking it a lot more seriously. So when they do uh, suffer concussion, they know that it's, it doesn't have to be a knockout to be concussion. They know they can get concussed without getting completely knocked out and are, are treating it a lot more seriously. Mm -hmm.